Okay, let's take a look around this uh, 1966 Morris Mini Moak. Uh, it's, this one is an original UK car rather than one of the later Portuguese or Australian ones. Um, very, very desirable. Um, obviously, as always, finished in spruce green, as I think all the English ones were. Um, it's a 1966 model, and it's apart from it's obviously been repainted at some point in its life, um, but in the original colour, it's exceptionally original. Um, it's spent over 30 years apparently in Spain. Um, hence the uh, the shell allegedly has never seen any welding. Um, I think the hood is original as well. Certainly looks it. We had a, um, a lovely one this time last year that had been completely restored and um, you can just tell one or two differences from a, a restored one to an original one and I think the hood is one of them. Quite happy to stand corrected though. Um, this one is fitted with uh, a 998cc engine which gives it a little, bit, little more pep. Still got the original three synchro gearbox though. Um, it's, got the, it's just basically correct in every way. Interior is all original as well. Um, we'll go around and pick out some good bits. There's nothing really not a lot in terms of bad bits. Nothing I can find at all. Um, it's got the, the spare wheel correctly mounted on the rear. As you can see, this hood is exceptional, and as we think, it is the original one. It's a little bit thicker than the reproduction ones. But again, I'm quite happy to stand corrected, but I think it is correct. We have got the rear side screens for it, but not the front, but that's not a lot of point in putting those on, in fairness. It makes it look like a greenhouse. Um, okay, let's start at the front here. Really nothing to um, to comment on adversely. The, the, um, the, the shell is beautifully straight. Shows no signs of any funny uh, repairs or welding at all. Uh, I know the subframes have, come, have, have been taken off and all uh, uh, sorted out. Um, but lovely round here. All the welding is great. Um, it's just exceptional. Inside here, I'd say the original seats. So the front ones are actually quite um, quite good. Um, the rear ones have got a couple of splits and nicks in them, just there and on the other side. And a couple of the straps have come away on the backrest on the uh, the offside one. But uh, as I say, the footwells. Are splendid as well. Um, it's been fitted with screen washers. That looks like a period fit, though, by the look of it. The only um, real difference from from uh, from standard is the steering wheel. It's like a period, slightly dished one, which I, I actually find quite nice on um, the big original thing, like a bus wheel. As you can see under the back here, it's all splendid under there. Hope you can see it on the video. So spruce green with limestone wheels is absolutely uh, correct in terms of its spec. Um, all splendid there as well. And this one actually, it dries better than the Concours one we had last year. Um, the one that had been completely rebuilt. It just feels really all of a piece, this one. Helps it's got the 998, it does give a little bit of extra pep. But uh, so around here it's all spot, absolutely spot on. Yeah, it's, it's on a day like today. I've had so I've just had the been driving it with the roof down, and I've had so many comments on it. Um, makes people smile this this thing. Anyway, that's about it. My name is Simon. You can reach me on 0771 906 9353, or in the office on 0118 907 1495. Or you can go to our website, which is www.motodrome.co.uk, for any further information. We take part exchanges, we take Visa and MasterCard, credit cards and debit cards, with a 2% surcharge for credit cards, and we can have it shipped or delivered anywhere you like in the world, obviously at a cost. That's about it. End.